What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Brilliant Diamond walkthrough. Okay, so, in our last episode, we started our little side quest adventure with, uh, you know, going through the first three places that we would find bodies of water, you know, just because we got the surf technique, and I'm a little parched right now, so, um, let me see, oh yeah, my handy dandy, yes, be phenomenal or be forgotten, guys, um, yes, hold on. Doing a lot of speaking right here. Anywho, so, yeah, we went through Bodies of Water, and now it is part two. We're going to be going through more land and more sea, more lakes and all that stuff. In our last episode, we found ourselves with uh, at the Fuego Ironworks, I believe. And we found quite a few things that we needed to find, including, uh, like, a few Pokemon stones and whatever. Um, I don't need to... Yeah, I don't need to travel this by foot, but maybe it's a smart thing because I do have a Pokemon egg. <laughs> Hold on just a sec. Hold on, I need to switch this. Um, there we go. Look at the Pokemon obtained. I, 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 yeah, you can see right here, guys, that I have not captured a lot of Pokemon. That will soon change. And, well, let's go right ahead and... Screw it! We are going to be... Uh, yeah, we're going to be... There's a reason why we have that egg there, and that is to actually wake up that Pokemon egg. I believe it's Togepi. Correct me if I'm wrong, guys. But, yeah, that's a total waste of a Max Repel right there. Okay, so... There is nothing in there in the forest. And now that we have the cut technique, we can just go through right here. And head into the next town, and look at that. Oh my god. Bam! Easy cut. Okay, alrighty, 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 okay, and look at that, we see some, uh, some berries that we need, so that must mean that we haven't talked to that lady right there, or we haven't been here at all, oh, so you know about the capsule decoration too, then I'll give you some of these stickers, and, well, look at that, we get some stickers, stickers are a big thing in Sinnoh, and, well, you'll find yourself a, a honey bearing tree, and, well, you'll find this right here, and grab this, we found ourselves silver powder, which can be used for bug type Pokemon to increase their attack. And this right here, we have found ourselves a TM82 Sleep Talk. Which, um, if I'm not mistaken, if you're asleep, it automatically... Like, use that move and it automatically uses a move by itself, I guess. I don't know. One of your attacking moves. So, there we go. Cherry berries. And more berries. Whatever. Anywho, uh... Yeah, this is kind of how I do things uh, with uh, when I'm when I was playing real like gaming, you know, real Pokemon games and all that stuff, guys. Um, every single time I get the Surf technique, it's always going back to the original, uh, or not going back to the original, but going back to like backtracking to different kinds of places. That way, I can get hidden items or places that I needed to find rare Pokemon and all that stuff. I don't think we're gonna be finding a rare Pokemon anytime soon. Probably, I don't know. Could be wrong. So here we are in Route 205, and yes, there is a large body of water right here. I think there is a spot maybe here and there where you can actually get some water or get some items, and uh, no, not right there. How about right here? I do not know. And wow, that was a waste. That was a total waste. Okay, so Eterna City it is, and well, the next place on my little on my little list. I'm not going to use up a repel just yet. That, that would be a complete waste of those max repels. Um, we're going to go right here. And we're going to be finding ourselves some more items. Some great items. Hidden items. And there we go. We found ourselves a bottle of PP up. Now, for those who are a little bit of a twist in the mind, it is not exactly what you think, okay? It's for their moves and all that. So, let's see. Uh, nothing right there. Again. Oh, you know what? Maybe there is something right there. Okay, so doing that. And nope, nothing right there. There might be something on the corner right there. Nothing, okay. So we're doing our thing, guys. We are doing our thing. And uh, let's see. This is where we use the repel, so. Okay, so there are, again, there are quite a few spots that we have not hit just because of uh, certain things. And I, I do believe we're gonna destroy somebody. Like, we're gonna beat them badly. 
It's gonna be bad. Okay, so you know what? Let's go ahead and uh, swap over. Let's go to Toothless. It's been a while since we used Toothless, and uh, Toothless is pretty awesome. Okay, so here we are, and oh, we already played them. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Okay, so okay, never mind. We already got the item right there. And we could go down to the bike route, but I kind of want to go straight here. And here we are in one portion of the of Mount Cornet. And unfortunately for us, we do not have strength yet, so we won't be able to get that item right there on the left hand the left hand corner. And uh, wow, look at that! We can't move, so we are forced to move on ahead. Okay, so let's see. Hmm. There is a spot. But I think it's strength. Yeah, Mount. That portion that I was thinking of is strength. So, let's see. Let's see, let's see. I'm gonna I'm gonna fly somewhere. I wanna see where it's at. Um let's see, let's see. Let's see, um, that will actually lead us there. You know what, let's go straight to the next town, which is Heart Home City. I know that we're gonna, I know that we're gonna be missing quite a few things, but it's like I said, it's piece by piece, guys. I wanna actually grab whatever I can, especially before 6.30 right now. Um, so, let's see, the next place right here is Heart Home City, and if I remember correctly, we can go west of here to Route 208, and you will be able to find yourself a few things. Let's see. Maybe a Pokemon here and there. I think we've already battled everybody. But if we go right here... There we go. Alright. Um, yeah, I don't know why I did that. Uh, let's see. Might be something right here. Yeah, oh, crud baskets. Okay, so we need more. We we definitely need more things than just what we had. So we're going to go right here to Route 208. And this one will lead us right here. And I don't think it's going to do much by surfing right here. I'm pretty sure you could have gone here any anytime you wanted. Let's see. Oh, you know what? Right here. You can go into this portion and grab this item. And here you found yourself a Dawnstone, which can evolve can help evolve a Roselia, I believe. Roselia, a male Curlia, and I want to say a Murkrow. Correct me if I'm wrong, guys. It's, like I said, it's been quite quite some time since I've actually played this game. Or any kind of Pokemon game. And well, let's go right here. This one will lead us to this spot right here. And here we have a bottle of protein. Gotta have your protein, guys. Every single time. Okay, so going right here. And we're going. And yes, we're gonna be using another repel. So, yeah. We are uh, we are putting in that work right here, guys. And uh, well, let's see. Huh. Well, what do you know? We should have gone here before, uh, so it never hurts to try. We're gonna go down to Route 206, and if you guys don't remember, Route 206 is a, it is home to a place of, uh, you know, a Pokemon that, you know, a Pokemon that you can actually grab, and well, let's see. There is something that I am missing, and I'm like, I'm like telling myself, wow, I can't believe you forgot that. Okay, so if you go right here, well, if you go right here, you will find a secret entrance right here. Actually, if I take this off, hold on one sec. Okay, right here. Two, three. Okay. Okay, there it is. Okay. If we go right here, you're going to enter a specific part of the cave. And yeah, I guess I was right. You need, you need strength for all that stuff. So, what's going to happen is... I am going to... I'm going to fly yet again. <laughs> Alright. So, let's see. Um, yeah, let's fly, let's fly back to Heart Home. And... 
go piece by piece. I know a spot where we're going to be finding a lot of items, much needed items and all that stuff. So let's go and use our, our buttons right here. And I just realized something. The, the plus and minus button are my select and start button. Wow. <laughs> a few episodes later. Oh my god. Man, it has been a while. If you guys don't know, or if you guys are new subscribers, um, <laughs> I, I have taken about a good four to five months off from speaking narr or doing narrations and all that stuff. And I've taken about three, two to three months off from, uh, or actually, yeah, two to three months off. I, I'm, I'm so confused now. Oh, okay, hold on. Trying to figure this one out right here. Um, so I've taken time off. I should say I should just say that, okay? I've taken time off from narrations because, you know, burnt out. And the current content that you've seen so far, which is my hack videos, those are from 2000 or the year 2020. And look at that, we got ourselves a rose incense. I just wanted to put some content out while I was on vacation and all that stuff. And uh, it seems to have worked out properly for you guys. And well, look at this, we found ourselves a TM11 sunny day and i am looking at this tree right here i'm like are you god dang serious oh my god yep this is how lost i have been guys super lost okay so yeah we're gonna be using this and oh there's probably yeah there's gonna be a place right here and well let's go right here you're gonna be finding yourselves some more Yes, berries. Lots of berries. Great berries. Awesome berries. And, well, let's see. There we go. And we got ourselves some tomato berries. Now, now that I'm thinking about this, I think we needed to go back to Twin, twin Leaf. Because there is a body of water and uh, something that, you know, that has a large body of water. I think we'll save that for last. You know, just, just for fun and all that crud. Um, let's see. Nothing right here. And, yes, we are looking at some items right now. Hooray for the surf technique. So let's go right here, use the surf technique, and right in this spot, we grabbed ourselves a TM-84 poison jab, which is a very, very good physical poison type attack. I just need to use it on somebody. Anybody. In fact, I like using poison type Pokemon because... It is very strategic. I, I see why Koga uses them now. And let's see. Go down here. There we go. Oh, I was kind of hoping that we. I was kind of hoping that we would skip something. And well, would you look at that? We found ourselves a Quagsire. Okay, Quagsire. I don't like you, and you don't like me. It is very strong, so I am going to capture it because. I think I should, you know. Alrighty, so here we got the quick glow. Let's go. Scratch him. Wow, he is uh, he is strong and oh my lord. Here comes its muddy Oh wow! I want him. Okay, so you have earned a spot and well here we go, Dragon's Breath, come on, paralyze it. And it is not paralyzing. Here comes a slam attack, okay. So, that Quagsire, I want. I want her badly. Alrighty, so, let's see. Let's go with a Hydra. Mainly because of its fine type capabilities and all that stuff. So, there we go. We, we intimidate it. And, um, let's go ahead and use a Pokeball right here. It is part of the water, so let's go ahead and use a Netball. It would be super effective right here. And come on, stay in the ball. Stay in there. Come on. Oh, balls. Okay. So it, it has its yawn attack. Wow. Okay. So we need to hit this Pokemon like right now. And yeah, let's go with this one right here. Wonderful attack. Well, never mind. But that was a very good Pokemon. Freaking Hydra. Okay, so there we go. We found ourselves a bottle of protein. That is great. And, well, we're coming up on our time limit here. So I'll be right back with you guys. 
That's right, guys. Be phenomenal or be forgotten. Anywho. It's kind of funny. Uh, a few episodes ago, guys, I have talked to you guys about the different kind of uh, equipment that I use just to, to produce these videos and all that stuff. One of the biggest things that, you know, I probably should have, I've, I should have been using uh, for quite some time, that was a bigger memory chip. And that includes, well, yeah, a bigger, bigger memory chip. And I'm talking about like, I'm talking about like 124? the 100s 124 gigabytes I think Four, yeah 128 yeah it goes by it goes by that by that fraction or whatever it is but yes uh, I got myself a bigger memory chip because in doing this by recording this this episode I am actually it's, there's extra time before the video and after the video and that takes up a lot of memory onto this camera right here and uh, well it was pretty. It was actually a very good idea to just put it with 128 uh, gigabytes because it actually shows me on the screen how many hours I have. And so far, right now, I have about six hours, mainly because I was recording the uh, the old episode right there. So, yeah, pretty good investment right there. And uh, let's see, you grab this, you got yourselves a Mystic Water. That right there is pretty good, fantastic, great, and well. Go down here. We're gonna we're gonna be surfing up, and we're not gonna be finding anything except just those guys. Huh. Okay. So yeah, that's pretty much it right there, guys. Uh, I kind of want to take it in, in in spots right here because in the next the next area we're gonna be fighting some Pokemon trainers. So I kind of want to save that for the next episode and uh, finish off with uh, going to Twin Leaf. I, yeah, there was probably no reason for me to. <laughs> yeah, there was probably no reason for me to just stop it and, and anything like that. So, thank you guys again for watching. Thank you guys again for being patient as always. I will be back for another episode of our Pokemon Brilliant Diamond walkthrough. See you guys.